hello everyone uh, my name is Abdul Muxit and today I want to show you how you can import uh, multiple or bulk data uh, into jet engine CCT custom content type right now they don't have any option uh, from the croco block side but you can do it by yourself manually so uh, right now uh, when we go to cus custom content type we have a type leads and inside lead I just took only two fields that is customer name and location and uh, both of them are visible here customer name and location so whenever you create a CCT it will create a standalone table in my SQL database right now we have WPJet CCT leads inside we don't have any data okay now first what we will do we will create a dummy post a dummy cct muxit and my location is suppose abu dhabi okay now when we check the data it's showing here with all the relevant information and the status let's go to the database and check here so we have the data here now what we will do let's export this item to know the structure and the schema of the table okay so this is suppose this is what we got from this one record now I will add some more records okay and the CCT author it means that who posted this CCT so we will keep it one for the admin uh, here we will change it to suppose 18 19 20 and so on you can have thousands of records here these are the dates we will keep it like that now what I suggest instead of having fixed date we can have my SQL function now which will insert the timestamp in the database and here we will use null okay null now <coughs> you can save it and import it directly but sometimes it will give you errors what I suggest let's copy the data and go to a sample tool which is known as mr. data converter and just paste it here okay now this is a CSV table and we will convert it mysql okay so it will give us something like that okay we will copy from insert we don't need to create the table again paste it here we don't need these details we will just modify the table name what is our table name WPCCT leads so this is our table okay now here <coughs> if you see closely the now function is encapsulated with the quotes uh, it means it's a string it's not a function and null as well so we need to get rid of that I will copy H we will replace it with now it's a function and null replace okay now now we'll insert current date and time and null will insert nothing to the database table let's copy and I will remove everything from here we don't need these details let's go and check our leads we don't have anything here let's click on SQL command and I will execute that column count does not match with you okay we are missing something this is ID name what are we missing here the problem is we don't have uh, the status column here let's add a status also and the status should be published all right copy the data and let's paste it here now we got another column also for the status paste it here we don't need that and let's run the replace command all right what is our table name it's cct leads 
paste it here copy the data and then let's run this query now we have five rows inserted let's check the data so cct leads we have the data see here it's null modified and the created date is as of now all the data is here let's check here refresh we have all our new data here okay if these modified dates are not updated because we didn't modify any field let's try to modify something whether the schema and data insertion and updation works or not let's save it so here we have the modified date and this is modified text if you go here and refresh you will see the modified data here also okay so this is a small tutorial of how you can import thousands of record in cct uh, tables of croco block if you have any question please write in the comments thank you so much